Well, good morning, everybody. It's Thursday. It's July 23rd. The month is flying by, isn't it? And all week long, we're looking at reasons why we should pray as we take these two to three minutes every weekday morning to start our day. So let me give you two more good reasons today. Here's one of them. Prayer is a securer of laborers. Listen to what Jesus said in Luke chapter 10, verse number two. He said, the harvest is plentiful. And he's talking about the spiritual harvest. People who are ready to come to Jesus, but the laborers are few. Therefore, beseech the Lord of the harvest to send laborers out into his field. Do you know what prayer does? God uses prayer to launch evangelism. We can pray and say, God, would you send more laborers out into the field? Would you put on people's heart a burden to share Jesus? Are you lacking workers in your area of ministry? Go to God and ask him to send more workers into your area. That's a purpose of prayer. And there's another one closely associated with that. In Colossians 4, 2 and 3, we learn this. Prayer is a preparation for witness. Listen to this. Paul says, devote yourselves to prayer. And in verse 3, he says, praying at the same time for us, that God will open up to us a door for the word so that we may speak the mystery of Christ. I love it. Paul said, listen, when you pray for me, pray that God will open up doors for me to share Jesus. Is that not an amazing prayer? Imagine what would happen if every one of us today prayed that prayer. God, today, open up doors for me to be able to share Jesus. Prayer begins the process of evangelism. Evangelism begins with prayer. Before you talk to people about God, you need to talk to God about people. That is a beautiful reason for you to pray today. So let's do that right now. Would you pray with me? And as we pray right now, would you just, wherever you are, would you ask God to send more people out into our world to share Jesus, more laborers into the harvest field? And would you do this right now? Would you ask God to open up a door for you today to share Jesus with someone? Who do you know that doesn't know Jesus? Well, before you talk to that person about Jesus, why don't you right now talk to Jesus about that person? Father, today, help us to share your word with others. And I pray this in Jesus' name, amen. Well, like always, I hope you'll share this video on your Facebook page. And I hope you'll join us again tomorrow morning. We'll wrap up the work week with our Friday morning check-in, 7.30 right here at E-Free Church.